Well, now to a 12 News I Team exclusive. Every week, the city of Phoenix releases updated crime stats. Tonight, we're analyzing those stats for you, breaking down the top crime zones in the city, and we're finding that there's a common link among several spots. Team 12's Bianca Bona joins us live here in Studio 12A with the facts that are unfolding tonight. Bianca? Well, guys, the city breaks down crime stats by city blocks, and we're finding a trend in the top five blocks with the most crimes reported. These five blocks with the highest number of reported crime over the past three years share one thing in common, Walmart. It's sucking up a lot of time from a law enforcement standpoint to spend a, a good chunk of their shifts at Walmart. Scott Wolf, an associate professor of criminology at Michigan State, published a study about Walmart and the crimes committed at the stores. There's spillover from the surrounding community of where crime was probably already high and it's just being um, concentrated in that location of Walmart because there's more opportunity um, for would-be bad guys to victimize people. The 12 News I team analyzed Phoenix uniform crime reports, finding nearly 5,000 crimes reported in the top five blocks, all of which surround Walmart stores. Topping the list with more than 1,100 crimes over the past three years, the Walmart near Bell and 19th Avenue. There's a partnership that's really been built with local law enforcement. A Walmart spokesperson telling 12 News they recognize crime as an issue within the company, which is why they've invested millions of dollars into resources to prevent it. One shoppers may notice before they even enter the store, lock cop. We really do kind of treat it as our first layer of defense. The Phoenix crime data shows theft is overwhelmingly the leading cause of crime at Walmart. Then come drug offenses. The technology is to a point where you can see things occurring not only in the parking lot but also off property as well as passing by in the streets. The deterrent device equipped with sirens, cameras and speakers allowing security officers monitoring the premises to communicate with potential criminals from a safe distance. Collected across the country we've seen where, where these are placed, the lock cops are placed, uh, we've seen a, a decrease in crime that occurs on a parking lot. A Phoenix police spokesman saying as we identify areas with higher crime rates, we direct our efforts in those areas. Walmart taking a similar approach. Their lock cop devices able to track crime at each store. The company, which has already put up 10 of them in Phoenix, plans on adding several more by the end of the year. We do provide a safe place to shop and a safe place to work. And you can take a closer look at crime near Walmart stores on our website right now at 12news.com. Coming up on Thursday night, we're analyzing more data and seeing which neighborhoods have seen an increase in violent crime and what's being done to stop it. Guys, back over to you. All right, Bianca, thanks.